2022 Honda CB500X, CBR500R, CB500F debuts with new features. New components of all these models are sourced from larger siblings Honda CB650R and CBR650R Honda will be introducing a series of upgrades on its CB500 lineup in Europe. These include the Naked Street Fighter CB500F, the Super Sport CBR500R, and the Adventure Tourer CB500X. Out of these, only CB500X is available in the Indian market which was launched earlier this year. These motorcycles have been hugely popular across Europe. The Japanese brand claims to have sold over 106,000 units of CB500 ever since they were launched back in 2013. Out of these, CB500F accounts for nearly half of those sales. The track-friendly CBR500R has accounted for almost 18% of the total sales. On the other hand, the adventurous CB500X accounts for 35% of the total sales volume. The new set of updates primarily focus on the dynamics of the motorcycles, which involves its suspension and braking setup. Additionally, minor updates have also been made to their powertrain. New riding dynamics for starters, Honda has equipped the 500cc motorcycle with new Showa 41mm SFFBP inverted forks at front, which has been derived from their more powerful middleweight siblings, CB650R and CBR650R. This is said to improve ride and handling of the bikes. Stopping power has been enhanced with new dual 296mm wavy front disc brakes, powered by radially mounted Nissan calipers. Handling has also improved thanks to lighter Y-spoke aluminum wheels on CB500F and CBR500R. The Adventure Tourer gets larger 19-inch light wheels at front, and also receives longer front suspension travel to assist it while traveling on undulated paths. Further, Honda has added a new and lighter swing arm, which is said to be stiffer rotationally on all three motorcycles. This has resulted in improved handling and cornering performance, by adding more lateral flexibility to the swing arm. Powertrain specs coming to the powertrain, all three bikes are still powered by the same 471cc parallel twin motor, which continues to produce 47 bhp and 43.2 nm of peak torque. However, after the latest update, this unit now features new PGM Phi settings to further enhance both torque feel and overall character. The engine is coupled with a 6-speed transmission with an assist and slipper clutch. Honda has also made updates to the color schemes on the three bikes. For 2022, the Naked CB500F will be available in three paint schemes, including Pearl Dusk Yellow, Pearl Smoky Gray and Matte Axis Gray Metallic. The fully fared CBR500R will be offered in a single color option matte gunpowder black metallic with new graphics, signifying the brand's racing heritage. The CB500 Adventure Bike will also be available in the same color as CBR500R. In addition, it also receives Honda's classic Grand Prix Red. This set of updates are not expected to be carried forward to the India spec CB500X anytime soon. CB500X is currently priced at RS 6.87 lakh, X showroom. Honda has released a first look at the 2022 Honda CB500 lineup the CB500F Naked Standard, CB500X Adventure Motorcycle, and CBR500R Fared Sport Bike. Already sharing many parts, the three CB500s also enjoy matching upgrades, at least in Europe. Let's check out the new goodies. The CB500s get the same Showa SFFBP 41mm inverted fork as found on the CB650R and CBR650R swapping out the old standard fork with these sophisticated units should significantly positively affect the handling. The off-road able CB500X and sportier CBR500R should most reap the benefits of a more robust fork assembly. Dual discs replace the old single disc brake setup. Check out those radially mounted Nissan calipers and 296mm discs. 
This improved braking dovetails nicely with the upgraded fork. The 2022 Honda CB500F and CBR500R get a new front wheel. Both 17 inches, the new wheel is a Y-spoke aluminum design that cuts weight. The CB500XS 19-inch Adventure Ready front wheel remains unchanged. A new swing arm is fitted to the three CB500s. According to Honda, the 2022 swing arm is lighter, more flexible laterally, and stiffer rotationally. An insider tells us that the change will improve handling and cornering performance. For Euro, where A2 power regulations hold sway, there's our new EFI settings. The power hits the maximum 45 horsepower maximum. However, the motor will now put out more torque. Honda gave us a peek into how the sales of the CB500s break down in Europe. Almost half of the buyers get the CB500F, while nearly a third go with the CB500X. The CBR500R makes up the remainder of sales about 18%. There are lots of new colors for the 2022 Honda CB500F, CB500X, and CBR500R. To start, all three models are available in Grand Prix Red a good start. The CB500F is also available in Pearl Smoky Gray, Matte Axis Gray Metallic, and Pearl Dusk Yellow. The CB500X and CBR500R can be had in Matte Gunpowder Black Metallic with CB500X buyers also having access to pearl organic green. Yes, Honda uses matte rather than matte. We don't know if these changes will apply to the 2022s in the United States. Sometimes the updates happen simultaneously, such as with the Honda Grom last year, and other times we must wait an extra year, as in the case of the Honda Monkey. We can tell you that sooner is better than later, 